major issue I'm seeing for the global 5G market is sustainability and how the 5G ecosystem players are advancing sustainability as well as their environmental, social, and governance goals, also as we uh, commonly see it as ESG. Now, uh, from my viewpoint, communication service providers, or CSPs, are now better positioned to fulfill their sustainability goals and missions, and that includes naturally those ESG objectives. And that is through actively managing a diverse range of ESG matters, including providing equitable access to connectivity. Obviously, bridging the digital divide is a huge objective for all of society. And integral to, to fulfilling uh, the sustainability goals is the ongoing commitment by CSPs to prioritize responsible business practices that promote accountability, transparency, and ethical conduct in meeting uh, these sustainability goals. Now, so for 2023 and beyond, I see mobile operator 5G sustainability initiatives hitting their full stride and the potential of uh, the 5G standalone networks that are expanding can deliver uh, even more the network wide and ecosystem support needed to innovate 5G networks and spur 5G driven sustainability. I also find that mobile operators, uh, their executive teams and their decision makers are expanding oversight on the execution and fulfilling these sustainability goals. And that includes the promotion of cross-functional collaboration between technical and sales and marketing units. So now the top 5G sustainability market shapers I see include energy management. And that is the administering of power consumption and its impact on the sustainability goals. Energy management frequently requires automated management techniques. So automation is definitely going to play a major role in all this. And it, the goal here is to minimize output of you know, energy uh, requirements while also assuring service level agreements or SLA compliant, which is all important. This is how the operators uh, definitely monetize 5G services. And that's, this, again, particularly uh, related to mission critical 5G enterprise applications. Plus, I see AI-enabled energy management platforms that are designed to decrease mobile operator energy consumption and costs by up to 30%. And this is important without diminishing network performance becoming increasingly deployed throughout uh, the highly distributed 5G infrastructures, again, 5G standalone. So such decreases can approach five-fold savings over legacy pre-AI systems that also require scheduled shutdowns, and that obviously costs the operators money. We need to get away from that. So for example, T-Mobile is committed to reducing its energy consumption by 95% per petabyte of data traffic by 2030, and that's from a 2019 baseline. So that's very impressive. And from my view, T-Mobile's identification of sustainable and responsible supply, as well as greenhouse gas reduction, energy and natural resource management, and uh, also waste and recycling improvements, as well as product life cycle management aligns with the top most sustainability goals of the mobile ecosystem. So in essence, all these things really have to come together to advance uh, 5G sustainability. <music>